sometimes the people closest to you don't want to see you doing no better than than they are. Today is vlog number five. I think it's vlog number five. It's March the second. And I am on my way to the GoPuff facility. to start my four till 7.30 shift. I'm double checking. That is four till 7.30. Today is Wednesday. Wednesday. So yeah, 4 to 7 30. So let's see. This might be vlog number six. <laughs> I think I, I done lost track. To be honest with you. It's 3.52 now, so I'll be there before 4 o'clock, <clears throat> excuse me, I want to double check, you just, okay, the 21st, that was one, two, three, four, five, six. So I, I assume this is vlog number six. I wasn't supposed to work yesterday, but yesterday, I don't know if you'll see this. I already know you're not going to see this until sometime down the line, but yesterday, which was March 1st, 2022, I picked up a shift. So for the week, I already have 19 deliveries in the bag. And the week starts on Monday. The work week ends on Sunday. So once I come in here and get this first delivery, that's gonna put me at 20, and then I'll get my $28 um, weekly bonus. That's exciting to have 28 additional dollars on top of what I'm already gonna be making. Hey. So far, I am liking um, this gig work with GoPuff. So far, I'm liking it. I had a situation um, once, which was Sunday. I had a situation, but with the way the weeks is running together, it might have been Monday that I had the situation. I, it was either Sunday or Monday where a customer didn't have the proper identification. So I had to do a 
a double back. And I ain't even get a tippy tip. I'm like, man, because of that, I missed out on at least two, two or three additional deliveries. So that kind of like, that kind of blew me like. But outside of that, I've um, been enjoying, enjoying it. So I'll see you at the GoPro facility. I apologize for the movement. It's the camera. It's unstable. I'm back. It is 4:35, and I'm just now getting my first delivery. So for the past hour, um, half an hour and two minutes, or should I say, for the past 32 minutes, I just been watching um, YouTube. I was watching uh, Rookie Riches. He was doing his go puff and I was just watching him. I just be getting my go puff education from him. For real, for real. No lie. I'll be sure to link his uh YouTube channel down below so you can check him out. He's a positive, uplifting individual. And you may like his content. So I'll leave his information down below. So that's what I was doing for the past 32 minutes. <laughs> So now I got an alcohol beverage delivery. Let's see what happened with that. <laughs> it's like, I guess it's like rush hour times where the traffic is heavy. Again, my apologies for having a shaky camera. If it get too ridiculous, I'll just probably log off and come back. But anyway, yes, I'm on my first delivery run. So this is number 20. Ah! I should keep my tongue in my mouth because that's not ladylike. But anyway. 1,000 feet. Turn left. This is number 20, so I get my $28 weekly bonus yes turn left onto maple avenue the sucky part about the area where the gopa facility half a mile turn right onto floral avenue let's try it again part about the location that the GoPuff facility is in is that the speed limit is 25 and it's in a prejudice area no cap Being who, being who I am, <laughs> I can't afford no type issues. Mm -mm -mm. Cause I ain't, you know, I ain't the right shade. In their, in their eyesight, it's one of those sundown towns for real, for real. Turn right onto Floral Avenue. Anyway, somebody almost had an accident. So in a quarter mile, turn right onto Slane Avenue. I get my bonus. My weekly bonus. Excitement, excitement, excitement. The, the sun 
sun's so bright today. It's giving people the impression that spring is almost here. <laughs> Turn the right onto Slane Avenue. Then your destination will be on the left. This is, this don't even look right. Shucks. There we go. I thank you. I followed my first nine. That ain't that ain't thing. That is not the street. That is not the street. Your destination is on the left. Okay. Me too, guys. I'm tripping. I'm tripping hard. Alright. So I passed the address because I don't even see the address. The joys of delivery. The way this thing be lying. I did not see that address. I, I could have swore I was going slow enough. <laughs> I'm like, this better not be going to this church. <laughs> I don't see no address. I don't know. Is this a, a church? A church? Okay, it's not going to the church. I'm about to say, is this a, a church in disguise or something? <laughs> Oh, shucks, I needed to turn around anyway. Ooh, let's see. So, this is a delivery that requires identification. So, I'm getting my phone prep to let the customer know that I am outside so that I can start the drop off process and um I guess my melanin got the customer's dogs hollering cause boy them barking so loud <laughs> They probably don't see melanin, you know, that often. But I wasn't scared. <laughs> anyway, it didn't take the customer long um, to come to the door. So once she once she appeared, she had her ID and was prepared for the delivery. So I kind of set the package down take the ID um, take a picture take a picture of the ID to be processed in the GoPuff app they approve it customer signs and then the order is complete then I make my way right on back to my vehicle to finish um, processing um the transaction as you will see once i arrive back to the vehicle another easy breezy transaction those the ones that i like all right just dropped off that order you got a nice little tippy tip Ooh. I got five ninety nine. That's what's up. <sighs> now what I'm doing is I'm thanking the customer for using GoPro.
Oh, and I also write down how much of a tip I get. I just keep like to just document all that I can that I remember. Now I'm on my way back to see what's puffing. <laughs> I thought I'd just, you know. I thought I'd just show you what, again, what I'd be doing. So I shall see you at the facility. This camera keep wobbly, 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 and it's driving me nuts, so. I think this is the same house I went to where they didn't didn't have an ID but thankfully they're not continue for three quarters of a mile they're not ordering anything that requires an ID because I ain't in the mood <laughs> for these people hoping to make money to also fund the candle business that I am interested in starting up I already you know got some things but there's a lot of other things that I need and the most expensive thing is the wax, the wax, the wax, the wax. The wax is the most expensive thing. That, that's a whole lie. The wax, wax is one of the most expensive. The wax and the fragrance oil are the most expensive aspects of candle making. I'm really, 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 really interested in Selling candles. I'm not, you know, I'm not sure who's who's interested in buying. Who's in a quarter mile? Turn left onto US 42 South Reading Road. And supporting me. It seemed like. Well, they always say the people closest to you ain't your customers. It's the one, it's the ones that you don't know. Turn left onto US 42 South Reading Road. Sometimes the people closest to you don't want to see you doing no better than than they are. Excuse me. Days. It's a good day. But it's just one of them days. Continue on US 42 South for two miles. So I guess maybe I'll check back on my on the second delivery or something. I don't want to bore you <laughs> while I'm driving. Cause you, just, you know I'm not really a talkative individual. You just be like, dang, she just driving she ain't said a word to us she just she just quiet i am I'm very quiet I'm like lord be a be a fit oh i gotta take this light i'm not sitting here be a fence when it's dark outside you know the freaks come out and i ain't talking about no kinky kinky people neither cuckoo birds the cuckoo birds them, them come out at dark and, and do the most mm. but anyway I'll be back hey y'all I am back and I am I have wrapped up my go puffing evening I signed out about a minute ago literally
and I'm turning on my street. I'm about to pull up my driveway. <laughs> so that, that drop off was at that same <laughs> location from two days ago. But let me tell you, the energy was so much different. Um, this time around and the transaction was very smooth <sighs> they even want to give me a cash tip <laughs> that's pretty cool I have to tell you about that uh, tomorrow I'll pop tell you about it tomorrow in, in vlog number 7 um, so this concludes vlog number six of my second week I, the whole it's a whole week of working with GoPuff let me uh see what my earnings are so three of the customers tip um One of the tips is off the books. <laughs> and the thing ain't working right to even do it. Come on. But anyway, as far as the own book tips, I have $12.73 and I have $18.75 in delivery fees for a grand total of $31.48. <laughs> So far, I have a total of 24 deliveries, and I also hit my weekly reward today. So I'm, you know, I don't have anything to complain about. It's all good to me. Some dollars beat no dollars any day. So I shall see y'all tomorrow in my vlog. <laughs> and until then, later. Thank <laughs> you.